What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Methodical Man here. Today we're going to be covering a trade that I took this morning for $800. Super easy mechanical strategy that anybody can do. I uh, did want to jump on here and just tell you guys that, <clears throat> just remind you that the Apex 90% off sale ends tonight at midnight as well as the Bulinox 90% sale as well. Coupon codes down below, link in the description. So check those out. They do help the channel. If you haven't already, hit the like button, subscribe. Let's get into the video. Got to jump in there long sometimes. Go long. I mean, the market might go down. Who knows? I mean, you never know, right? It's early. Early in the day. You don't know what direction it's going to be. Could be a red day. Could be a green day. You just don't know. Let's see. Mancini just tweeted out. What did he say? A few minutes ago, I didn't read it. 30, 43, 55, 43, 36 remain below 67 range of support. Where do we pull back into? 73. Given we are ranging, though, beware of liquidity grabs under 67, in particular on any spikes to third. 50, 50, 50, and then back up again. There you go. I definitely don't think you should walk away and let it do what it do. I might get tagged in here, guys. Manage that thing. There we go. Quick pop. We're going to need a quick pop above the whole number here and uh, right into the tens in order to be able to lock in a little bit of profit. If we falter at all right here before we get through that whole number, we're in all likelihood going to be stopped. In my opinion, can't be any 90 drama here. This thing's just got to go straight through that whole number. Got to get this volume to just pop it right through there. Pop it right through there. All right, there's the 90s. Got to go, got to go if you're going to go. You're going to try Juker trying to short at 295. Can't fade me, Juker. I'm long. Wait for it to come back down. to. First, we got to go to 326, Juker. Then we can look at the shorts. <laughs> down to 200 and counting. Listen, it's always recoverable. You can close it at any time. Now, it may go back down. I don't know. We never know, right? You never know what price is going to do. I want to see a strength right through this whole number. Get to the 07s. 309 incoming says excommunicado. I like the way excommunicado thinks here. I like the way, I like the way he thinks. Seems reasonable. 309 would at least lock me in 10 handles. Oh, there we go. Nice little burst. Come on. We need more. I guess I should consider where the uh, 10 handles is. Uh, what is it? 08. I'm getting ready to move her. No, wait. That's not right. 98. <laughs> You're getting to the end of your rope. It's not that big a deal. You're only down 200. Not that big of a deal. All right, I don't like, I mean, I normally like the push above and then the pullback, but I really don't want it in this case. We want it to just, if it's going to do that, we want it to push into the tens first and then it can pull back. Give us what we need before you try to pull back on us. They don't always listen to what we want, though. You can do it. You know you want to go to the 09s. The 26. Yeah, that's not what we want to see. We don't want to see a... I mean, it's okay if it pulls back. Problem is, 
Yeah, I don't guess our stop is at 73, theoretically. Shouldn't pull back that deep, but it sure could. Yeah, 337. Yeah, I like that. I like that better because uh, that would give me my 38 handles. That would give us the 38 handles, so that would be nice. So now you kind of want to see it hold 90. You don't really want it to lose the 90 here on this pullback. If it does, then uh, we're in trouble. We would be in trouble if it loses the 90. Coming up on the top of the hour here in just a few seconds. So you want to see this thing put in a nice little ABC here. ABC, boom. That's what we want. Got to see the buyers pop in over here on the WADA. Got to get us going. You would like a retrace to the 80s? <laughs> no. No, the 80s. Uh, 88. That'd be fine. I'd rather it just go. Usually you get a pop above to like the 05s. We hit 03. And then you get a little pullback. Mid 90s and then go. Well, it's 10 a.m. now, so getting a little pop, a little pop of energy coming in here, right here at the 10 a.m. mark. Can we make it into the uh, tens here? I think we can. Boom! Just took a quick long on the other account as well. Logging in 08. Now we got to see. Um, 20, no, 17, 50. I go based on where our entry should be, not where we actually got in at. So. Twenty six incoming. Let's go. Now. Twenty two fifty. 22.50 locks in 30. I don't know if there was news, Predator. I didn't even look, to be honest with you. Probably a bad idea. We know how that turns out sometimes. So guaranteeing $800 here. Can't lose. Down 300. It's not going to, I don't mean, you know, who knows, Kip Poker. I don't know if it's going to keep going or not. We banged a little bit on that PA right there, that Bulinox, $650. And locking in $400 or $800 there on this one. Right there, balance is now 156, 296. So $2,700 away. 